so I've been a little nervous. I'm out here all by myself. I don't know this place very well. And I'm more than a little concerned about bears. Not that I expect to see a bear, but I do know that if I am surprised by a bear or surprise a bear, that, that typically doesn't end well. So I've been letting them know that I'm here. Hey, hiker. Hey, I'm here. I may not see you, but I'd rather not see you than surprise you and have an issue. Hey, bear. Peace. Hey, I'm here. Just about a mile in to my walk today. Beautiful scenery here in the Shoshone Canyon. And I came across this. What a wonderful, wonderful place. What a wonderful place. And somebody else thinks so too. They've been stacking firewood and they have a pot to cook with and a place to sleep and water and a broom to brush out their little cave. What a wonderful spot. God bless you, whoever you are, and I hope you're safe, and I hope you're good, and I hope God is with you, and I hope the universe is on your side. Things like this is why you should go out and hike. Where did you come from? How did you make it there? I know you didn't survive, but that's amazing. And look, there's still hope. Got another one trying. And another. And another. How amazing is that? So I started on the other side of that bridge in the distance, came up over that rise, and then along this trail, past that little, whatever it is, electric tower. I don't know what that is. I'm not sure what it is out here. You can see the trail cut through the canyon and right over the top of this hill to be right down here where I am. Great little hike. It's taken me uh, 33 minutes and 45 seconds to get here and to do some filming along the way. Anyway, hello from Shoshone Canyon. Hello from the side of a canyon near the Wild Bill Dam. Right there. Tree bonsai. Right? I've come to the conclusion that this is some sort of communication tower. And I'm very, very proud of the people who put the fence here. Because if that fence was not there, you know what I would have to do under obligation. I would be forced to do something that's probably illegal and go climb that thing. So thank you on behalf of my wife, my child, my parents, and everyone who cares about me. Keep up the good work, communication tower. It is, in fact, a microwave tower. So there you have it. Don't worry, I won't enter. So it's now thundering and lightning, and I'm a little nervous about that. You can see it's on the other side of the canyon, which, which is a good thing, and I hope it stays there, because I have all these power lines that I'm walking under with these big, tall metal posts. So let's, let's hope it stays over there for now. Oh, and by the way, um, whenever I came to you last time, I was standing right there from the other side. And now I'm back almost to the bridge that we saw earlier. It's been a great hike. Um, I've been gone exactly an hour and 38 seconds and it's a little over, it's almost two and a half miles. So it was easy, it would be great for a family if you're in Cody, come out here, there's an easy pull out. Um, I'll show you where it's at. And it's real simple, um, it's great grade, nothing too strenuous or too hard. It would be great for, for families. Oh, and by the way, wonderful scenery, as you can see behind me. I think this is called Cedar Mountain. Um, it's absolutely gorgeous out here. And sage smells wonderful. As do the, I guess it's, I don't know, some sort of pine tree 
it's fantastic. I don't know exactly what kind of pine tree it is. I'll figure it out, but these, these things, they're, they're everywhere, right? And they smell just like, I mean, just like Christmas, like Christmas. That sage is spectacular. See you later. So here's the pullout. I actually parked right down there, but there's plenty of space right down here below to park. That's the road to Cody, going that way. There's the bridge, and beyond it is the road going down Shoshone Canyon to the Wildville Dam. Nice, easy walk. Great afternoon for it. And it's still not raining. Thank goodness. So this was apparently once a road. You can see the sign behind me there that says, hey, it's not a road anymore. Um, but it's a great little spot. Loved it, it's fantastic. There's, there's the bridge. So I had to stop and tie my shoe uh, because it has come undone. So I'm going to tie my shoe. And while I tie my shoe, I'm also going to enjoy the scent of this absolutely lovely sage plant. Not much better than that. Sage is fantastic. Did I mention how lovely the sage is?